Hey, hello, hello, Mana here, and welcome back to Tomba. Picking up here where we left off, not really knowing what to do, and nothing has changed in that regard. Uh, yeah, so I still have no idea really where to go, but we do have this new flying ability, which means it, it could be uh, possible that that is needed to get the uh, pig bag that is in the forest. But I have no idea where that is. It could be a quest reward, like... You know, it's, it's hard to say, so really not much to go off. Uh, the only potential lead that I have, uh, going off what you say, Legovich, which was uh, questioning whether there was uh, any mice outside of the, um, outside of Bacchus Village, which I had not thought about, so. Because uh, you, you did mention the one at, well, it's, we can go straight to Phoenix Mountain, can't we? Now that we actually have super dog powers. Where are you, Baron? There you are. Yes, yeah, so we can actually jump straight here, which we will go to, yeah, Storm Mountain. Yeah, because you mentioned the digger there, which I'd not even... Like, I, I guess there are mouse? I'm not, I'm not sure. I hadn't really... I don't know. I hadn't associated with them with the mouse, or I'd forgot about them, or I, I didn't notice, or... But yeah, because I just sort of put the, that in the back of my head as being, like, updating after the win, but... If, uh... Yeah, if they are, in fact, a mouse, then that could definitely be something. Um... That's about all I have to go off right now, other than the fact we do have this wind power, which could be helpful for something but uh yeah which i'm not actually sure how it works completely still doesn't seem to always go off properly for me can you not do that buddy i mean is it just yeah like see right then it's definitely full and i pressed x but it didn't do it so i don't know if you have to jump a certain height or it won't work or you've got to be falling maybe it's that like you have to be oh can we get up there Oh, that's only the other side of that thing anyway, isn't it? Okay. That won't meet. Uh, let's get a lot. Ooh, that was interesting. Okay, so it got a bit... It seemed like I actually got propelled, like, further than, uh, using it, um, what do you call it? Horizontally. And not just up in the air. So that's interesting. Yeah, maybe it is you need to be falling to activate it, or... Because that, like, most of the time you would do that. Like, if I just do it... Yeah, it seems like if I do it real quick, nothing happens. Falling, and then that uh, damn it! <laughs> Please don't throw me down to the bottom. Okay, that's all right. That's all right. Uh, kind of seems like the fire one is better for getting around. Uh, this has got a bit more of a specific usage, whereas this one's actually a really good weapon. So probably best to stick with that for right now, especially with these friggin' whatever the hell you want to call these things. All right, let's take a look. Oh wait, did I? Yeah, one down. <laughs> I was meant to... Oh, shit, what? Respawned already. Not cool, man. Yeah, you. Are you not a... I don't know if you're even a mouse or what you are. Well, back to work. Huh, oh, okay. Not uh, not actually sure if this dude is a mouse. Or if he was, he's still just doing his thing. So I don't think there's any updates there, but... Yeah, they did get me thinking if there are any other mice around, because there was one up there, but I'm pretty sure he returned to town. That's when we got that newer monster quest from. Which, uh... Hmm. We might want to take a look at the uh, current events that we have. So we do have 15 open. Phoenix Mountain, so that's... I mean, yeah. Find a way to open the rusty door. So that could be anything, like... Might need to talk to someone that I'm not thinking of. Hmm. And fix the clear, which they're connected, obviously. Jungle pig bag, that's... Yeah, 100 flower forest. I need a tear bottle. Oh, right. Can we do that now? Like, maybe they're at the mushroom forest? Cause that's the only other, that's the only place we've heard of the Bonsuge. Hmm. Maybe we actually need to do that to progress. I mean, hell, even if we don't need to do it, anything that we can do is something we can do, so. <laughs> hmm. I wonder if the different color ones act any differently or like, can they all be beaten the same way? Hmm, hmm, hmm. I guess we'll have to see. I'm also wishing I'd made a coffee before I started, but no matter. Still good. Well, if they are here, that's nice and straightforward. In a sense. I don't know if it'll solve our problems, but... Hello? 
on Suge-san's? Hmm. Not looking very promising. So I don't remember, I don't think there was any other, like... Hmm. So what was there? There was, like, about, um... There was other stuff, was there? They needed the tear bottle to capture the tears, and there was something about the rise and shine powder. But I think all that comes after we actually have the tear bottle, so... Get tear... So, yeah, was there anything mentioned of where they were? I don't think so, other than... The mushroom forest scene plays, I can think of where it mentioned anything. Uh... But we may need to do something before they're here, but you'd think they kind of would be after that, like... What would we need to do to have that happen? Ouch. Uh, I mean, we can take a look on this side as well, obviously. Oh. That was good. Although, God damn it, I hate this place. <laughs> Dressing me out there, Mother Mushrooms, I tell ya. Yeah, I don't feel like they would be... Hmm. Because I assume we get a tear from one of them ones, or... Oof. Like with the uh, big ones, the white face and interesting lips. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, I mean, I don't see any Bonsuge here. Uh, what else do we get? Or where else can we go? What do you, like... So... Right, so what about that island off the, um... Like, what you can see from the watchtower. Is that r l related to the... Like, is that, I was thinking, is that Mas Masakari Jungle related? But I don't, I don't know. They're different, that's definitely connected, because we looked at the map. But that place over there, like, is there a way I can swim there that I've, I'm just blanking on? Because, like, we do still have, yeah, we still have the red pig bag and the blue pig bag. Um, we also still have, uh, that place where we can swim. We could try and go back there. Seems like a stretch, though. Because we went there recently and nothing seemed to have changed even though we could swim. But we have progressed a bit more since then. Uh, I'm not sure the best way to go there. Probably straight from the start, eh? Oh! Oh, we can go straight there! Damn, that's convenient. Uh, what else? What else? It's a bit of a head scratcher. I feel like everything's been sort of wrapping up nicely. Then we get to this door and I'm absolutely puzzled. I don't think wind's gonna help. Hmm. But it could be... Well, that's the thing. I mean, there is needing the pig bag, I said, with the jungle, but that's like... That doesn't really solve anything else, does it? Because if it was a quest reward, we still need to do quests to be able to get that. And if we just found it, then that doesn't do anything because I'm not aware of any other door. So... Yeah. Interesting, yeah, there's multiple ways you can get over here without swimming, which is interesting. I'm kind of wondering if we don't have to, like, meet the 10,000-year-old man before this or something. Just because there's that chest here, that's a... yeah. Like, yeah, I, I don't know. There was this turtle in here that was, like, a interesting dude, but didn't seem to be anything. Hello? I still think we may need to be able to, like, dive or something, but... I am wondering about the, the, the watchtower place, though. Is there any other water we've dealt with? I can only really think of, like... The back of the mansion, but... I don't think we, uh... Did I try to get back in the water? Like, after he takes us on the boat? Like, can we actually get there? Uh... Hmm. Is there any way we can do that? Okay, we have to just go through Mushroom Forest. Right. It's something to try. I'm, I'm, I'm grasping at straws here, man. Okay, we are back here. I f oh, we disappeared. Okay, he, he was still there. Okay, I didn't want that to just uh, cross the screen, so... Yeah, I kind of thought that was going to be a stretch. Can we turn? Go the other... No, okay. Uh, what about this door? We can't, like, interact or do anything, because that's also a rusted door, which is interesting. Can we, can we climb up somewhere? 
That actually looks like there's an area there. I don't, I don't think there actually is, though. Uh, for some reason, the um, UI stuff doesn't actually show in this area, too. Oh, that's interesting. I don't think it's actually anywhere, though. Hmm. I don't even know why I'm going up here. I honestly just have no clue where to go. I mean, look, if worse comes to worse, and I absolutely get stuck, I'll probably just, like, check on that one quest and get a hint or something. Uh, but I do want to, you know, I want to exhaust all options before that. Like, I don't want to get stuck and just not be able to play, because that'd be, you know, I don't want to spend hours doing, you know, ridiculousness, but I do, I do really want to give this a proper shot. Uh, I mean, maybe... Maybe you should look at the map. Uh, no, I don't want to exit. All good. I don't look at the map too often. Maybe it'll give some idea of where we could go. Like, is there a... Oh, shit. What did I press? Damn it. <laughs> That's not... I'm, st I'm still good with menus. That's something. Alright, you gotta click into that. Okay. So, there's some water there, which is interesting. Can we drop down in between there? Um, so there's water around there. I think of anywhere like we can actually access water. So we have, uh, what's that? Village of All Beginnings Mansion. Oh, okay. So we've got that middle area, which is like a thing we can get to at some point, I guess. We can't right now. Oh, the man- oh. Wait, no, that just leads out to... Yeah, the the wine thingy, right? We tried down that little side area that's weird, doesn't go anywhere. Uh, can we continue- can we not move further from there? There's also- yeah, that cave, but that just jumps to there, right, right, right. Uh, can't seem to go over the other side of the map. It's like, because there's nothing connecting it, it's not actually letting me jump over. Okay. Uh, let's... I didn't actually go through all of the, um, the events. I mean, there's got to be something that stands out, right? Let's go right to the end here. Where the barrel rolls, that needs a dive. Famous digger. Visit the famous digger and finish digging his hole, which he has not finished yet. No idea whose mirror that is. Tree of knowledge knows. Go to the wise old tree. All oh, right, that was. Oh, did we? Was the was the door after that? Could he know? Did I? Okay, let's go. Let's go try the tree. I didn't even think about that. Because I, I, I'm forgetting uh how that went. Nonetheless, that's something. Okay, moment of truth. I'm not, uh, not confident in this, but this is a message from old Gramps here. This old tree knows so much that people call him the tree of knowledge. He says in the future, if there's anything ever you want to ask him, you just come right back here to see him. Well, I do. I want to ask things. Okay. Guess that wasn't very uh, likely to work. Hmm. Okay, I'll, uh, I don't know, I'm gonna do things and I'll get back to you. <laughs> ooh, 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 I think I found something. I, I just came back here to, um, talk to the Bonsuge guy again, because I thought, I couldn't remember, like, if I'd missed something about that, like, I, I didn't think I had, but, you know, grasping at straws, so. But, yeah, this is the, he just said, uh, Iron Castle Door. Hmm, oh, the Iron Castle Door? That door is so old. It probably won't open unless you blow it up with a bomb or something. Oh, ho, ho, I need a bomb. Okay. I think we're good. Ah, oh, that was lucky. I, I was really close to just, like, looking it up and taking a hint, but I thought I would try the Bunsuge thing first, because I didn't think it was, like, a... It didn't seem necessarily like it was a main thing, but we did get it in the same area, so I thought there might be some connection or something, but... Yeah, anyway. You want me to make a bomb? Ha ha ha. What a gullible little fella you are. I was just joking. I guess no one has gone to such lengths to try and open the door. Come to think of it, I do have a bomb. I made it a long time ago, but it's dangerous and I didn't have any use for it. So I hid it in the jungle in the highest tree. 
It looks like a coconut, but actually it's really powerful bomb. Oh, that, oh, that's safe. Even that iron door wouldn't be able to hold it up against this bomb. Be real careful, though. Okay. Have you ever heard of the flower tears? You can get them from the flowers in the mushroom forest, but you need a special bottle. I found that you can get this bottle from the yellow Bonsuge. He used to live up in the mushroom forest a long time ago. Now that the evil pig... Oh! Right, that's what I'd forgotten about. There's only one flower in the... Yeah, 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 yeah. I'd forgotten about the whole bread. Yeah, okay. Things are becoming more clear. Okay, so I just need to go to... I mean, that, that sounds familiar. Like, that sounds like where that pig door was. Which is pretty close to here. So, alright, I guess we can just hop out. Uh, I don't know where else. Yeah, I'm pretty... I feel like there's actually a coconut on that tree, right? Something. Because it's literally, like, right here, so... Uh, wait. How do we actually... No, it is literally this, right? Yeah. Yeah, right there. Oh, th yeah. Okay. Well, that suddenly clicked together quite nicely. Hell yeah. It was nice to... I, was, I, did, I really didn't want to look it up, and I was... I was pretty tempted, because I'm not against it or anything, but it's a lot better when you can figure it out in game, you know. Well, I'm happy about that. Okay, it is splody time. Fella, you best move yourself away. Oh man, the iron castle looks totally helpless now. Jeez, oh, huh? You've, oh, right, this, okay, you're just gonna repeat stuff, okay. Alright, let's, uh, hopefully just use the bomb. Not gonna do oh yeah he's right. okay that looks good oh we're like leaving the room well hey you asked me to do the job or I volunteered or well, something e either way oh I wonder if you so do you reckon we can get another bomb for that door the mansion break the rusty door clear thank you or you're welcome yeah probably you're welcome very good. Which now we can presumably fix the clock tower. Uh, Tumba, what are you doing? I didn't do that little jump. That was Tumba's uh, whole thing to get things working again, apparently. Oh. Ah ha ha ha. I know where that is. That I do. Okay, we have things we can do. This is good. Hello, buds. Well, I sure do you over. I sure do owe you a favor. Say, I hear that you're traveling in search of the evil pigs. Wait right here, okay? I've heard that a ten thousand year old man who lives near the large pool at the top of the waterfall knows all about the evil pigs. Oh, oh are we? Oh, okay. This is getting good now because we might have like a shit ton of chests to go open with all sorts of goodies. Why don't you pay him a visit? You'll need to go through the village of old beginnings to get to the top of the waterfall. The detour is a pain in the neck, but good luck. Oh, if we get the new key, oh, it's going to be good. And a new place. To oh, wait, we don't need to fast travel freely anymore, do we? I was thinking because we'll probably get a bell like we do with the others, but... We have Baron now, so... Yeah. The door to the old pond is locked. Here, take this. It's the key to the door in, at the old pond. Uh... Okay. Thank you. Ride the raft from the hill with the old tree to return to the haunted mansion. Wait, what? Ride the raft from the hill with the old tree. Okay. I'll leave the raft at the factory so you can go ahead and take it. Okay, some of that just went straight through my head holes. Uh, I don't, what, what door is he talking about? Old pond. And an old tree. Oh! The, where we were. Oh, uh, oh, 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 okay. That just gave a lot of new meaning to what he said. Can you repeat that? I've heard that a 10,000 year old man who lives near the large pool at the top of the waterfall knows all about evil pigs. Why don't you pay him a visit? You'll need to go through the village of all beginnings to get there, to get to the top of the waterfall. Did you always pay the net for good luck? Ride the raft from the hill with the old tree. Return to the haunted mansion. I'll leave the raft for the you can take it. So... Wait, what, what's the Haunted Mansion got to do with anything? Or is that just a shortcut thing? Okay. 
Uh, okay, some of that just... Okay. The old pond, yeah, that's where... That is that, right? So we can now use that door, which goes to... Wait. So do we have to go through that door to get to him on top of the waterfall? Did, did I... Did I understand that correctly? Um... Hmm. The Village of All Beginnings is the first area, right? Because... Yeah. Alright. Sure. Listen, I just came back from the Village of All Beginnings. While I was there, I saw her, the witch. Her name is Mizuno, and, well, she's really cute. Oh, I wish I could see her again. The cute witch. Okay, of course. Perfect Japanese game quest there. Listen. Oh, yeah, yes. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll let her know you think she's cute. Don't worry, buddy. I won't let you down. So we have a raft here we can take. I don't, I don't know if there's any reason to, but... Because, like, why would we want to go to... Like, what's the point of going from here to the... Is it just in case... I guess, I guess I'm not factoring in, like, some people wouldn't have Baron right now. And if you run out of charity wings... Yeah. Wow, I can't believe you got the machine to work. Thanks to you, the clock tower has come back to life. Hmm? You can't, you can't go in the room with the cogwheels? Ah, uh, I can't? What room? <laughs> oh, you can't go in the room with the cogwheels? There are giant gears in there and it's very dangerous. Uh, okay. Oops. I thought there was a raft vent. Oh, we were saying you can't go, we can't go back up there, is that? Okay, I thought this was what they meant by the factory. Is that the other way? Oh, is this? I don't, I don't know what's happening. Is this the raft? Maybe. Hey! No? Aww. I guess it just won't work with normal water. I must think that stuff to make a fuel bar. Oh, this is just another event. Oh, nice. I'm glad I checked around then. Hmm? Oh, I didn't realize you were listening. This is called the go-go cart. To make it move, I need a fuel bar. The problem is, I can't find the ingredients that's needed to make a fuel bar. All I need is a little bit of wine. A bucket full should be enough to finish the motocross course. Oh, well that's... okay. That's interesting, because the, ra the uh, raft takes us to Bacchus Village, where the wine is. Although I don't know... Oh, that, that is... That, that. Okay. All set on the raft. Uh, so wait, does that mean we can put the raft into the water? And I assume that means we can survive going off the waterfall or something? And that'll take us to Bacchus Village? Did I, did I connect those dots correctly? I mean, I said connect the dots, but I'm pretty sure it was actually stated quite clearly, so... Not sure if that actually applies. But yeah, just jumped here, so I assume... Well, I assume... Yeah. Yeah, don't know why I double said that. Um, or said that twice. Yeah, I assume we just get in the water and use the raft then? Uh... Yeah. Yes? No. Okay. Do we need to use it... Okay, do we have to use it at the waterfall? Some, like, I don't... I know we can just travel, but I'd like to know what the hell the raft is for. Uh, okay. Didn't it say something like this? Or was it supposed to be somewhere else? Oh! Oh, I think I know. Okay, I could be mistaken, but I think it's actually this place in here, like, that looks like somewhere you could jump down. Can we... there we go. Yeah, with a, like, big hole in the ground. I mean, the raft was just here, so... Pretty sure this is the spot. Yes? No. <laughs> Damn it. What did they say? Where, like, because they mentioned the raft at the factory, but where are we meant to use it? Unless you just have to be at the bank of the water to use it. That, that might just be what it is, eh? Okay, let's see. It might be at the other side, so I don't know if this will work anyway, but... Let's see. Raft. Okay. <laughs> Can I get... Okay. Maybe I have to... Yeah, I'll, I'll try from the other side, I guess. It must be here, though, right? I didn't... I mean, I, I should have paid more attention, obviously. That's, that's one thing. But where the hell else would we use it? Okay, this took me longer to figure out than I would like to admit, but let's just pretend it didn't. And there is a pier thingy right here. This better work. <laughs> I did not notice this before. 
I swear it didn't even exist. Just now. Yeah, of course it is. God damn it. <laughs> uh, there we go. Let's ride the raft. Oh, this is cool though. So, this takes us to Bacchus Village. Which, oh right, it's a good thing we didn't just take the quick way then, since that was actually an event, wasn't it? Oh. Oh, okay. Huh. Alrighty. Good stuff. But I assume we can just jump to the old pond from here, right? It's a very, this is a very weird thing, right? We, we use a raft to go from Old Tree here all the way to here, then we have to go to Old Pond to go through a door to get back to where we was, but just up the waterfall. Like, is there a part of that that I'm missing, or is that exactly how it is? So that's certainly, uh, interesting, we'll say. Although also interesting is that, like, originally at the start of the game, we were restricted, like, basically by that guy saying about, like, learning to swim and stuff. But yet, we've gained, like, two different methods of actually getting across this water without touching it by the time we actually get here. Because we can get across with this, and we can get across with the, uh, parasol. So, yeah, kind of interesting. We can just do that, like, easy. <laughs> I assume this is gonna if the, if that like why why such a weird way to go about this. Well, here we are though, the underwater pig bag. Oh, no wait, where are we? Did I? I thought we were going to the top of the waterfall, or is that unrelated? Did I just completely like? I, I felt like I read that text and nothing soaked in. I'm gonna save Trick Village. Or maybe the 10,000 year old man is here? Or are they separate things? I feel like I should go back and like reread that whole thing. Uh, I think we're good there. Okay, I did go ahead and actually reread all that. And yeah, it's all correct. This, this is where we're meant to be. I think it just like, it's just kind of weird though. Like, I mean, there's so many questions. For one, why? Why? The other, how, why, why does he have the key? <laughs> Well, why did that dude have the key to the pond here? And, I mean, I don't even understand how the map connects in this, in this regard. Like, how do we possibly... Like, they're so far away, right? Oh, okay. So I guess... Right, okay. So this ends up taking us off through here up to Trick Village. Which, I guess we have to go through this to get to... Like, we have to take... Oh, I don't I don't really understand how that works, honestly. <laughs> but I... Oh, I guess they meant... Oh, because that waterfall is just there. Oh, right. I guess that... Yeah, no, alright. Yeah, they're really not that far, like, when you... Yeah, okay. And I assume... After we meet the 10,000-year-old man somewhere here... We'll actually be able to go to here? Hmm. Okay, alright. Things are making sense. Things are making sense. Although, if so they continue making sense, I'm going to make a quick coffee and then we'll uh, see what's going on here at Trick Village. So, while I was making my coffee, I just realized this is like underwater, but we can't actually dive yet. So, if we don't learn right here, there may actually be something else we need to do, which is going to suck because I'm out of ideas. So, please learn. Okay, another good... Oop. Oh, right, I was about to say I could use fire mode, but that would actually be a terrible idea. So hopefully we, uh... Well, I assume it's underwater, right? Ow. Okay. Can we... Is it... Wait, is this the 10th year... Blah, blah. Is this the 10th year old man's house? Oh, shit, it is. I mean, it's got to be, right? Like, how you doing, bud? Who do you think you are entering someone's house without permission? The 10,000 year old man? How dare you address me so casually? That's Mr. 10,000 year old man to you, young man. There we go, the 10,000 year old man. Oof, we have some chests to open. The story of the evil pigs, eh? I see, you must be the one the 100 year old man and the 1,000 year old man were talking about. Hmm, well, how does this sound? As you can see, the trick village is sunken underwater. There are 10 math beads with numbers on them hidden in the water. 
If you can find all the beads and bring them back to me, I'll tell you everything you want to know. I could probably do that. The ten math beads. Okay, okay. However, you can't collect the beads just by swimming through the water. You have to be able to dive underwater. Ha ha ha, hey, don't give me the dirty looks. Alright, fine, I'll give you one hint. Just a while ago, the mermaid came to see me. She said she found an important item that she had lost in the waterfall, but she can't get it, she can't get to it on her own. The poor child looks so depressed. If you help her by getting the item for her, then just maybe, maybe she'll teach you how to dive. The mermaid should be resting at the haunted mansion right now. Oh. Okay. It'd be, it'd be kind of a, it feels like a slap in the face from the other place where... Oh, well, actually, no, I guess because you can, you can go straight there. Like, but yeah, we, like, if you're going the way, proper way here, you you go to that, then you've got to come straight here, then you're going straight back, but... Yeah. We, even if you don't have any charity wings or baron, you can still use the bell, so... Not actually a big deal. Uh, yeah, you're just repeating that, so good. Alright. I'll, uh, meet you at the mansion. So, an interesting how it's still being called the Haunted Mansion, which... Like, because wasn't that only because of the spell, or... Was that unrelated, and they just made it more haunted? Because it seems pretty friendly now. Huh. Uh, as to where the hell we're supposed to find her... Oh, I wonder if she's... Yeah, actually, I wonder if she's around, uh... Where we come up. There is also over there. Uh, I think I'll check this way. Oh, here she is. Hello. I do not know why you're here, but... Hello, nonetheless. <laughs> What am I going to do? How am I supposed to get my necklace from the waterfall? Uh... Wait, I thought I was supposed to come see her. Did I misunderstand something? The underwater pig bag, ten math beads. Broken fountain, when the wind... Uh, did I get a thing for it? I'm very confused. Okay, I went to read that again. I was like, oh my god, is something going over my head again? I'm not doing too well this episode, but we are making progress. So that's something. Uh, but yeah, I guess we actually have to get the item first to bring it to her. That's kind of weird, though, because, like, there's no event. Like, we didn't get an event by talking to her. So I don't know if bringing her the item will just activate the event, or... But then, it's meant to be at the top of the waterfall. Like, that's what the old dude said, but... I don't know, could we have just kept going... along to do... I don't know, hmm. Okay, so we actually said in the waterfall, but I assume, like, maybe we can just keep going this way? Oh, there's a chest there, nice. Yeah, I don't know if we can actually just, like, go off the top of the waterfall this way or something. Oh, seashell necklace. Wait, that's it? Uh, <laughs> you serious? It was in it? Okay. Wasn't really expecting that. Alright, I guess I'll <laughs> meet you back at the mansion then. Okay, hopefully this works, because it just seemed really strange to me that we didn't get the event beforehand. What am I going to do? How am I supposed to get my necklace from that waterfall? Well, I got it for you, but... Okay, no, it worked. What's this? Why, it's my necklace. Did you go get this for me? Thank you so much. There we go. Oh, all right. I guess we didn't actually need to get... Oh, nice. Hmm? You want to learn how to dive? Well, you've come to the right person, then. I have something I need under the water here. If you can go get it, you've mastered the art of diving. What's underwater? Question mark. Question mark indeed. Let's start by getting you in the water. Okay. <laughs> nice. There you go. Now, see how you float automatically? It's not that hard to learn how to dive. Now, try pressing down. Press the directional button to submerge your head. I didn't actually press that, but sure. That's good. Now, to move forward in the direction that you want, press the directional button and the special button at the same time, right? Now, just like that, can you get the item I need from underwater? I have no idea what the special button is, so... You got the hang of it. It's doing it itself. <laughs> I was not really doing that. Yeah, he's just he's just doing it himself. I'm not controlling this. And even that was not me. Okay, that, that's really weird. I, I don't know why that... Okay. Well, do you think you can handle diving now? 
Since you got this for me, I'll give you some mighty fish food. I don't know much about it either, but I've heard that the mighty fish will appear when you put this food in the water. Uh, sure. Wait, why am I back in the water? I was looking upwards just then, I looked down, I'm suddenly in the water again. And should I be using this? Alright, let's actually try. So what is the... Oh. No, you can just move around with directional arrows. So what the hell is a special button? I don't know what the special button is. But it does seem like you can swim faster with a uh, square. Yeah, I have no idea what special button is. You can just move around like normal. Okay, this is a bit of a weird case. Um... Yeah, I'm not sure about this Marty Fish one. Let's, uh... Where are we at here? The Ma Yeah, Marty Fish food. Catch a Marty Fish. Is that... Like, should we try it here? I don't know if it's a renewable item or not. I might want to save first. Hmm. I'm going to save first, because I don't trust anything in this game. <laughs> I don't know why, but nonetheless... Okay, let's try it out then. I don't know if this is really the best water for it, but... Can't use this here. I kind of thought that might be the case. It does seem like an odd choice of water. But it seemed to automatically put us back in the water, so... Okay, uh... Do it maybe have to be under? Or maybe it is something to use back at the, uh... The old dude's house. Because I assume we can just go straight back there now and continue on with the, uh... What was it? The math, whatever that math quest was actually called. Oh, that's... Okay. Using X, you can, uh, do that, apparently. Alright, cool, cool. Okay, well, very good. I guess I'll, uh, meet you back there. Oh, wait a second. Wait a second, before I forget, yeah, yeah, we can go to, uh, that thingy that's a thingy that looks like cement. And that's the best that I'm going to be able to describe it, apparently. Uh, the, uh... Oh, I've got all the words for this. Apparently, Dwarf Forest, and... I guess we... I guess Watchtower, yeah, because that put us down the bottom, yeah. The thingy that, uh, popped up from underground. So I don't know what the hell that is, but... I figure we should go check that out before we actually move forward with the main stuff. Which, yeah, I guess we have to complete that before we get the key, don't we? So it'll probably be in the next episode. We're going to have to sort of go around the whole entire game that we've opened up so far. and Because, I mean, there, there is, like, there's red chests from the start. There's... Oh, man, they're all over the place. I don't know if there's as many as some of the others, but... Oh, shit. Okay, that worked. And it's just down here? Yes, it is. Oh, what is... Oh, right. That's completed. Nice. Okay. Well, yes, what is this? Oh, it's an elevator. Oh. Okay. Cool. Not sure where it's taking us. What's under the forest? Oh, alright. God, we're clearing, uh, clearing all sorts of stuff today. Okay, so my brain isn't been working, but we've been making some good uh, progress. That's, that's something. Oh, wow, yeah. So we've got 101 open right now. Very nice, very nice. Okay. Oh, hello. How are you? Dig, dig, dig. Phew, digging is my life, but this wall is pretty difficult. Hold on, I promise I'll open up a way to get through for you. Oh, alright. Dig like a mole. Oh, so that little dude, yeah, it wasn't a, a, a mice or rat or whatever up at the Phoenix Mountain. It was a mole. Ah, I see, I see. Oh, nice, a friendly chest would have to awkwardly jump on. <laughs> Needle gator teeth. Okay... So, how long are you going to be, bud? Is this, uh, here we go, we're digging. Alright, we'll just leave you to it. Do we have, like, a save down here, or... Do we need a save? Cheese! Okay, we're still collecting cheese, then. Okay, we have a chest there. I've heard that a fortune teller is in the underground maze, too. I've never met him, but I'm sure you need some ridiculous amount of AP points. Oh, is that right? Is that right? Okay. Well, I guess we'll, uh... Because there's that, there's that over there. I would like to get the... Can we... How do we get in there, then? Or is that what we're waiting for to be dug out? Ah, okay. 
And we... Another red chest. Another red chest. Uh, hello. Hey, 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 step back. You're gonna get hurt. Alright, alright. Can we... We cannot open those, apparently. Okay, what about going... Oh, hello. What does this say? No? Hmm? Well, what a pleasant surprise. I hardly get any visitors anymore. Did you see that door that won't open? I did not. The thief's door. Oh, okay. Oh, well, I did see a... Okay. The door was built a long time ago by thieves who were trying to hide their stolen treasures. I don't think an ordinary key is going to open that door. You probably need some tool or something that thieves use. Come to think of it, a while ago, a friend of mine said he lost a very special wire at, wire at Trick Village. Uh-huh. Okay, so this place seems... Yeah, we'll be opening up most of this after we do that stuff then. Especially, like, with all these red chests here. Okay. Well, we can still take a look this way. Or is this another little room? Oh, no, it's actually a... Okay. Loading screen. So, this is another area then. Oh! Is this... Oh, okay. Wait, is that the one... Oh my god, it is! Oh, mystery solved on that then. There you are. Here, this is for helping us. Hey, you didn't even give me anything. Okay, is this an... Okay. Interesting, so do these guys know about this, or... Why do they have access to the secret maze? And who are these moles? Hmm. Interesting stuff, alright. We'll see if there's anything else we can do down here, otherwise I guess we'll just have to come back here after we finish up the Trick Village stuff. Uh, could we get along here at all? No. Oh, it's just a wall, okay, it just looked funny. Ah, alright, I guess there's nothing more we can do down here. Okay. Ah, right, so the food for fuel one. Bring back a bucket of wine for the go-go car. I feel like that's one we could do right now. I mean, it, it has to be Buckers Village, right? And we still have a bucket. I just don't know where we actually collect it. Maybe if we... We probably should go there and just chat. I mean... I don't know, is there like a well or something there? Uh... Oh, there's... What does that actually uh, say? Very rare and valuable needle gator teeth. Oh, okay. Alright, how is everybody doing? I'm pretty sure there's like a... Isn't there a well or a... Isn't there something here in the middle, or...? Ah, yeah, yeah! Is this... I don't know if this is like... Because, I mean, the whole village seems to, like, run on wine, right? They have a lake, so I don't know if this would be... Uh, where are we at? Bucket. Can we do that? No. Okay. I feel like this has to be the place to... Oh, wait, there's a, there's a thingy up here. Maybe? Can we use the bucket on this? Is my brain actually working? That'd be absolutely lovely. In both cases. Ah. I feel like it was still a pretty good thought. <laughs> hey, Tumba, long time no see. What's up? Need wine? Alright, as long as it's not for you, I'll let you take as much as you want. But don't you drink it, young man. Oh, here we go. Oh, nice. I, I knew The only reason I talked to this dude is I thought, oh, wait, I don't think you were here last time. Alright. Was that just, uh, is it in bucket form? Looks to be. Man, dude just gives out buckets of wine. It's kind of generous. I guess we didn't need the bucket we already had. That's fine. Okay. I assume that we kept the bucket for a reason. It would have made sense, eh? Hey. Alright. Uh, we shall go back then. Uh, who do we have to return that to again? Oh my god. I can remember things. God damn it. Oh, right, right. It was the go-go car guy. Oh my god. I just read that. Hello, my good man. I return with wine and good tidings. Uh... Oh, right, of course. You have to make me use it. We can't just have a conversation, can we? Ay, ay, ay. Here you go, buddy. Whoa, th this is Buckers Village's famous wine. Passed on for 14 generations. No one else makes wine like these, this anymore. Lake water? Are you kidding? This is premium wine. Never mind, it doesn't matter. I'm not going to drink it anyway. All right. Let's see now. This goes here, and that goes there, and it's done. There we go. Fuel bar. Oh, wait, we got a fuel bar out of that? I thought you wanted it. Well, gotta go. I'm gonna test drive this baby. Adios, amigos. Have fun, buddy. Oh. 
I wonder if... Wait, so we got a fuel bar out of that. I wonder if we can use that at the go-go car near the start of the game. Hmm. That could be a thing. That could be a thing. Oh, we still have the wine. Ah, okay. That's kind of weird. Uh, wine. This, huh. Yeah, I thought we were just giving him the wine and that, but we ended up getting a fuel bar out of it and kept the wine for some reason. Hmm. Okay. Okay, let's test this out. I mean, it's sitting here. It's been in the start of the game. There was even like a little, uh... Uh, what do you call it? Cinematic thing when we come in here, so... I feel like it's, you know... Gotta be, right? And, oh, we can! I mean, I felt like we had to be able to, but... I wasn't really certain about it. Oh, okay, where's this gonna take us? I have no idea. Is it just gonna be a little event thing, or are we going to a new area? Possibilities are endless, honestly. Oh, shit, what? Hey, you, are you in the race? First, be sure to pass the finish line before the time runs out. The finish line of this dirt motocross course is near the mermaid singing rock. If you break the post past records, I heard the mermaid will give you a medal. Oh. Uh, did we lose the fuel bar? Well, are you ready? Oh shit, okay. Well, I'm gonna have to like reload a save if we fail and... Oh my. How does this work? Uh, I don't know how this works. What are the buttons? Oh, we didn't get that. Oh, there's some good stuff here. What? Oh, you can press the uh, square to jump. Oh no. Oh wait, that was good. Ah, uh, okay. Are we gonna get hurt now? What's the but? I don't know what the buttons are. <laughs> not knowing the buttons, this is not good. Okay, that wasn't good. <laughs> Can we do over on that? I have no idea what the buttons were. It seemed like Square jumped, but then I slowed down a ton, and I don't know why. Did we lose the fuel bar? That's the question. We didn't, okay. As long as we didn't lose the fuel bar. The record is... Ooh. Okay, I guess... Oh, shit. I was going to try and turn down, but... Crap, I, I wish I'd saved before it, rather than... I don't know when I last saved. Oh my, what? Uh... Okay. How... Well, uh... Sure. Don't even know how to process that. Um... I'm going to meet you back there. I guess we can do it over and over. And maybe I'll know the controls this time. Uh, I just went into somewhere I didn't realize you could go inside, I don't think. Uh... Wait. Wait a second. Is this all... Wait. Have we... Have we always been able to go into this door? This is the door just before the motocross track. Was it locked? Wait, what? I just, I hadn't even thought about it. I was literally just going past. I'm like, wait, that's a door. And then I tried, and I could. Has she always been here? There's no way, right? Oh my god. Because, I mean, that's got to be the cute witch, right? I mean, yeah, because that, that dude said he'd been to the village of all beginnings, but I didn't even... Oh my god, okay. Why, hello there, sweetie. Me, my name is Mizuno. Mizuno the Witch, yeah. How, what the fuck? Has she been in here the whole time? I don't know why, like, I think because, like, because I said, like, as a kid, I've played this over and over at the start, but I never tried that door. I'm, I'm all but certain of that. I mean, for the most part, I didn't get to many doors playing as a kid because I would replay these same start areas so much. Okay, I'm mind blown. I'm gonna have, like, just, like, on myself, I'll have to go back and check at the start of the game if that's even possible to get in here because... Maybe you can come in here, but it's empty or something? Oh my god, okay. Why, hello there, sweetie, me? My name is Mizuno, Mizuno the witch. Cute witch, yeah. So, you want some magic candy too, eh? 
Well, it's not that easy. To make candy, you need a biting plant flour, some silver powder, definitely some molasses, coca claws always, and flavor a brutamushi thorn. And secret ingredient, ne needle gator teeth. I actually have a surprising few of those. Stand over there in front of the cauldron and place the items inside. Well, I don't have them all, but I got some. Do you have anything else happening? Oh dear, where could I have left that now? How in the world could I just forget three large crystal balls? Oh! Oh, is she the one? I wonder if they're in the watchtower. Without my three crystal balls and mirror, I won't be able to make that now. Mir Wait, the dirty mirror? Wait, are they the... Are they, the, are they one in the same quest? Well, what have we here? This is what I've been looking for. Why do you have them? Oh, never mind. I'm just glad someone found them. Thank you. Wait, so this one you... Okay, this one you can actually just talk for. You don't have to use. Well, I like that. Now I can make what I wanted. Are you curious what it is? It shouldn't take long to make, so come back in a little while and I'll show you. Oh my god. I cannot believe it. Wow, I've actually cleared a bunch today. This is really good. Focus, 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 smokers. Don't bother me right now. I'm busy, okay? Ah, <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, clearing up some uh, long-term stuff, too. Yeah, this is really good. Just sort of breaking my brain a little as well. But that's fine. That happens sometimes. Oh, your magic mirror, though. Is that not then? Unless the... Because she mentioned a mirror. Oh, I guess probably they're separate because that one was already a thing. Okay, let me actually try it then. Uh, triangle, you'll get me there. Magic mirror, okay. Can we really clear up both on her? Because that is it's quite nice, actually. Wait. Where's the mirror? Ooh, that didn't bug, did it? I, I mean, dirty mirror. I'm saying magic mirror, but... Ooh, that's concerning. Wait, what? Yeah, the dirty mirror's gone. Or maybe when she... Maybe when she makes what she makes, that'll actually be that one. Hopefully. Yeah, I mean, that makes sense, right? Probably. I assume we just probably have to leave and come back, or... Okay, let's see. There you are, I was waiting for you. Here it is, a magic mirror. Oh. Okay. This mirror has incredible powers. It will power up any weapon. Do you have anything we can try it on? I mean, yeah. Oh, you have all sorts of things. Let's see, let's try the grapple and the blackjack. Now we reflect both of these in the mirror and voila, there we go. Two weapons combined into one. This is the grapple jack. Oh, hell yeah. Well, that's pretty nice. Because I haven't really used the blackjack in a while. Oh, that's sweet. I actually want to equip that. That is very cool indeed. Well, thank you very much, cute witch. Oh, ho, ho, look at the range on that bad boy. Oh, hell yeah. Wait a second, what was the extra, uh... Wait, did we clear the cute witch one? Or was that, uh... I don't know if we need to do something else for that, or did that clear? make candy uh where is it oh the key okay oh, it did okay don't mind me all good i'm the only one that can use the magic mirror but why don't you hold up to hold on to it oh all right thank you ah 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 chew hmm take two of these okay oh is that is that all I walked out and came back in because I thought maybe I'd have to update again, which, yes, but that wasn't clear. Uh, okay, I, I mean, do we have, I don't think we have anything that would make sense for that, do we? Cheese? Probably not. Healing mushrooms? Probably not. Oh, wait, no, no. Okay, I'll have to. We'll leave it at that. We made some good progress on there. But uh, I think we'll go and try that race again then. Because I assume... Well, actually, I already forget... <laughs> God damn it. I already forget what we needed to, to break for the uh, the mermaid to give us something. But I assume there's probably something for getting the, the gold record too. 
All right, let's give it a shot. I guess we can do it unlimited times. Uh, damn, I saw the things, didn't I? Fuel bar, that's the one. Still not uh, clear on the controls. Is there any problem? It's. I think it might be X to accelerate, but I'm not actually sure of that either. <laughs> So we'll just have to see how we go. And holy shit, I just realized we're over 700,000 AP. That's quite a lot. Whatever was being referenced uh, in the underground maze thingy, I'm pretty sure we've covered for that. Are we good? Well, are you ready already? Hurry up, time's running out. I'll try and hold X and see what happens. Okay, it's not. You just have to press forward, I think. Okay. Uh... Oh, so you can... Okay. Seem to be going a little bit better speed-wise. But I'm not sure... I'm not... It seemed like you could jump, but... Maybe not. Oh, so this area, I don't know... Yeah, I obviously messed that up. I don't know how you meant to... Oh, that was fuel. Well, yeah, okay. Can we... Can we start and retry? Because I don't, I don't understand what the controls are. It'd be really great if it told you. Because <laughs> like you push, you have to push to go for like. But you throw your okay, you throw your leg backs anyway. I think I don't know. Do I hold? I mean, it seemed like maybe I just thought I was jumping when I wasn't. Oh, I think. Oh you, oh, you have to actually press what it says on them signs? Is that what I was misunderstanding there? Hmm. Okay. I still feel like that was terrible, but maybe that's what it was. I don't know. I don't know. I don't think we did very well on that one again. <laughs> what does this say? The record? Oh, right. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, not doing great on that. Yeah, can we go... Okay, sorry about that. Had a bit of a sudden cut there. Uh, you may have seen. Hopefully I don't mess up the edit. We did just clear something which I assume was mermaid related. So I don't know if we actually got like a low enough time or... Because apparently I did not pay attention to that either. I've just been... <laughs> I haven't slept very well, but I think it's just the... Probably more my usual self anyway, but I don't think that's helping. But yeah, so I don't know if we cleared the... Was it the mermaid one, or...? There's no mermaid here. What the hell did we clear? Uh... Mermaid's necklace. That's already... We did that. Uh... Mm, uh the mermaid's singing rock. Oh, maybe we didn't clear one, maybe we got one? Oh. Hmm. Okay. I guess we have to go back and try the track again. And I'll double check what that actually was. Ah, so it was actually that bronze metal one that we opened up from that, which is kind of weird. I don't know why that opened up when we went to there. But also, does that mean there's actually going to be an event for each metal? Because that doesn't seem crazy, although there's only really... Maybe there's one for bronze and one for gold? Hmm. Okay. I really should have paid attention to um, what the original goal was too, but all right, I guess I'll just meet you back there and we'll uh, attempt it again. Okay, it was only mentioned to break the past records, so I don't know if that means to, for like, for that the mermaid singing rock one, I guess we have to actually beat gold? Because that's, uh, that could be kind of tough, yeah. I also went and healed up because we were down to two flowers, which didn't seem great. But uh, I guess we'll try this again. I'm still less than clear on the controls other than possibly just holding right and then pressing those buttons where it says. So we'll see how we go with that. Hopefully that works out. Because that, yeah, I, I didn't pay much uh, attention to those. I didn't really know what the signs were. They like, it looked like something was crossed out at first or something. I wasn't paying attention enough to realize that was actually a button thing. Which I mean, I assume at least. But yeah, I don't know though, because I mean, we sort of go all weird here, like we turn too much now, and I don't know if that's something I'm supposed to be like 
leveling out a bit more, or we'll see how we go. I'm just, I'm just gonna hold right, and I'll press buttons when it says I just missed one. <laughs> God damn it! I have no idea what that said. Oh, wait, there's two tracks too. How does that work? Okay, I just pressed a button, but nothing happened. So, was that helpful? I don't get it. <laughs> Is there some, is it the timing? Is there something else? Hmm. Okay, maybe we need to like, the next one just experiment. Cause I, I really don't get what the controls are. All right, we're going again here and hopefully you can figure out how to actually jump. I, th I, I don't know. I thought originally I pressed square and it jumped, but I think maybe I just went off a lip and thought I did, or I'm not sure. Maybe it's just X to jump. I don't know. Wait, we'll see. I mean, I think it only, like... It's that water bit that seems to be killing us. Like, that that must knock us off, like, multiple seconds, so... I think if we can figure that out, we'll be okay. Because they are little bumps, so... I don't know. Let's see if we can... Okay, we don't jump here. Is that a jump? Oh, I think maybe it is X. Because I, I boosted just then. It seemed like it. Okay, let's see, does that work? Can I jump? How do I, uh, I mean that was faster. Oh yeah, X does, I think X is jumping when I feel that, okay. Actually I think that was a bronze medal. Okay, that was better. Nowhere near a gold though, like we need to shave like three seconds off for a gold. But if as long as we can, I uh... don't oh, know, let's see, can we go get a bronze medal for that? I'll take that. I wish there was a better way to actually get back and start the race again too, rather than have to fly back each time. Why hello there, you're pretty fast. Congratulations, you get the bronze medal. Why thank you. I assume that's going to open up a gold medal one? Or silver? One more thing, since you're the first one to break a record, I have a special present for you. Take this. Oh, awesome. Oh, that cleared that as well. Oh. Huh. Well, next time aim for the silver medal. Good luck. Oh, so there is a silver metal one, okay. I thought because there was only that one gap there that it would be a, a gold one, but... Okay, nice. Uh, take a look then. Uh, somewhere. I think I jumped ahead a bit there. Oh yeah, okay. So that, well that's nice. <laughs> yeah, I do want a silver metal though. There could still be a gold one, I guess, but... All right, well, let's try and at least get a silver record for today, and I think we'll probably wrap up with that. Okay, so it's actually like almost 25 at first, so... Yeah, we actually don't need to shave that much off to get the, uh... Get the second one, so we'll see how we go. Uh, maybe we'll aim for gold if there is, in fact, an event for it. Uh, I mean, otherwise we'll, we'll do it later at some point, but... I mean, yeah, because we'll probably want to get a gold anyway, because you might get something for it, but if it's an event, we'll, we'll try for it today, yeah. That made sense, right? Oh, the bronze medal is actually an item in here. Interesting. Can't use it though. Okay, I wonder if that'll actually come up for something then. Um, what are we looking for? Right, the fuel. There we go. Yeah, so it seems to be jumping is the key, which we did do better on that one, but not good enough. Oh, is he biting it? <laughs> He's like jumping on that like he does other things. Oh, Tomba. You're a silly boy. Okay. Wish we could practice in that little... Okay, we can't. <laughs> I like, I, I'm pretty sure like jumping with the X is correct, because I, I sort of felt the feedback of a few times when I bopped up in the air then, so... I think that is the way to go, so... I don't think there's really any part that matters that much. Like, I mean, there's a few little bits here that look awkward, but... Ultimately, it's only the friggin' water part that seems concerning, you know? So I don't know if we need to jump anywhere else to break the time. Oh shit, I didn't press it properly. Nah, damn. Alright. <laughs> yeah, that didn't go well. Ah. Pretty close though. Pretty close. What, what was it actually for silver? 26... something. What was it? Ah, 55. Okay. 
All right, all right. Okay, so I think for this turn, we'll, we'll do similar, but I think what I'll change for this one is where there's the blue, which I, I assume is water, and really be paying attention beyond it being blue. Uh, it's, I've been jumping off the ramp before it, then trying to jump on them. But I think maybe if I just roll off the ramp and then jump on the first ramp, like the little ramps, it might make more sense. If that made sense. <laughs> yeah, something like that. So over here, I'm just going to stick with it. Yeah, just going straight forward. I don't think I need to really jump here. I don't know. I don't trust the jumps, is one thing. <laughs> but this all seems pretty okay, like speed-wise, you know. Yeah, okay, this also seems fine. Yeah, but over here, so I've been jumping off this, but I think I won't do that. Jump. Oh, that worked better, that worked better. Okay. Come on. Oh shit, that was... Oh, that was actually close to gold. Oh, oh, okay. I think we've got a method here. Let's see if, uh... Yeah, because that was, what, like 20 milliseconds off or something? Yeah, that, that was really close. Okay, yeah, let's, uh... So we get our prize. I assume we're getting a prize, or do we just get a medal? <laughs> Probably just a medal. And an event clear, so. You've really improved, not bad at all. Congratulations, here, take the silver medal. Dun, 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 dun. Very good. But, the next race is for the gold. Oh, so it is. I want a gold medal. Ah. Huh. I mean, makes sense, but like, where is it then? Because you think they'd be all together. It's kind of weird. Uh, where are we at? This is, oh yeah, what? All the way here. Oh, also, now that we've learned to dive, or wait, we haven't actually learned to. Oh no, we did. God damn it, my brain today. Holy shit, it is absolutely worse than usual. Yeah, but we can uh, do the uh, barrel rolls thing too. So I think we'll uh, save that for the start of the next one. I, I would like to just try and get the gold medal for today, and I think we'll wrap things up. This one's also been a bit split up. I've got uh, interrupted a couple times, so that hasn't really helped with things, but I did want to get in some Tomba time, so that's good. Yeah, because it's getting a little late here, actually. Nonetheless, I do really want to get the gold, so we got at least a couple more tries. After, yeah, each time we've got to, like, do this, then wait, and jump across, then load screen, so... It feels like you should just be able to go backwards and straight back onto the course or something, I don't know. It's not a big deal. Since we only actually have the gold left, to make things a little easier, although, be optimistic, we'll get it this time, uh, but if not, yeah, I think I might just reload, because I did just do a save, which is just across the river from here, so probably be a little faster to just load saves if we're going to fail on time. Or even quickly stopping before the end, maybe? Well, anyway, stay optimistic. <laughs> actually did pretty well last time, I think, so... I think we we'll probably try the same. I think it's really just that blue spot. Like, if we can get that a little better, um, I think that's probably good. I don't know if there's any other spots here that are worth jumping to get some, get a speed boost. Like, I don't know. I did a little jump then. I don't know if it was worth it. <laughs> it seems pretty fine speed-wise, honestly, up until this area. All right, we drop down. Jump, jump, jump. Okay. Okay, I don't know if I should have tried to jump that pig. Ooh, damn. Oof, so close though. Hmm, where do we get that little extra speed? That's so, like, it's so little extra. That was literally, like, 14, is it 14? Yeah, 14 milliseconds there, okay. Ooh, that's close. Okay, so I think for this one, like, I think the pattern currently works. We need to shave off, literally, I said that was, like, 14 milliseconds. And I think if we can jump over that pig that is, like, the pig that is after the blue area before that jump because I feel like we slow down quite a bit from that so I don't know if we can actually like I don't know if we can jump high enough to clear a pig because there isn't a setup for that one but running into it seemed to really knock the time so if we can do that I, I think we can just about pull off gold which uh, it's a cool little track this isn't it like but it's definitely not a I feel like it could have been cooler I don't know it's not the smoothest thing like it's a uh, I don't know, it's like, it's cool, but it's very clunky, like, you sort of jut around and, yeah, I don't know. I feel like they could have done a little more with it, but I'm probably complaining about nothing here, yeah, honestly. Okay, good. Jump. Oh, you could, yes. Come on, come on, come on. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, that is, oh, no, there's a win. There was a win. Oh, yeah, nice. 
didn't, I disappointed myself, and I was like, oh wait, that, that is actually a win. Don't know what the hell I was thinking, but... Oh, hell yeah. I'm quite happy with that. Man, we've actually, we've cleared a surprising amount of events today. And then it was the witch, that was still, like, kind of blew my mind that that door actually went somewhere. I'm still curious if you can access that at the start of the game now. Congratulations, you've done it. You must be the world's fastest Tomba motocross champion. Well, it's named after me, apparently, so... I suppose Tomba's development staff must be ashamed of themselves. Oops, what am I mumbling? Okay, that was a weird fourth wall break. Anyway, from this day, you are the champion. Gold medal acquired. I don't know, is that meant to be harder than it was? Always aim higher. Thank you. Can we chat any further, my lady? No? Okay, fair enough, fair enough. Yeah, how are we looking on event numbers now? So 93 completed, 112 open. Yeah, we, we definitely knocked some out today. That's for sure. All right, well, I think we'll leave things off here at Wobbly Wharf so we can pick up next time doing the barrel down below thingy. Where does the barrel roll? I think it's actually called. Uh, so we can do that one and then we can head back to the 10,000 year old man's house, uh, do the 10 math bead one. And that should sort of roll us into other things because, uh, yeah, there's a few things going on that sort of opened up from that. So I assume... Well, there's the underwater pig bag, so I assume we might actually be finding a pig bag, actually where that old dude is. Well, then they're actually together too, so we may be getting another pig bag next time. And then, not sure about the jungle pig bag though. Uh, but yeah. Either way though, once we actually do that stuff, presumably once that's done, we'll get the 10,000 year old key, which means that we can go back to, well, the, yeah, we can go back down to the underground maze thing. Because there's, oh yeah, it's got a few things there, so yeah, with the 10,000 year old key, that means we have to go all over the place to open up chests, uh, including back to the mansion near the start of the game, and obviously a whole bunch of other areas, but also down to the, yeah, underground maze where there was a few of them, and what else, what else, what else, uh, like I'm forgetting something, well, either way, lots of things are happening. <laughs> they should roll together, and hopefully I'll be uh, more coherent next time. I don't know, I feel like I've just been a bit blur. Although it's probably more of just the usual, you know, hearing something than forgetting it immediately. Although, forgetting something not even like the right word. It's sort of a weird thing, because it, it says, like, read something, a little bit later, bloop, it's gone. But it's not actually gone, because I'll, I'll be able to remember it very clearly at some point later. It just could be an hour later, could be a week later, or... <laughs> I don't know, I guess that's just ADD for you, isn't it? But anyway, I'm still enjoying myself and managing to slowly get through it, so that's all that really matters. Uh, well, as long as you're enjoying it too, that's ultimately also what matters, of course. So yes, for now anyway, I'm going to stop my rambling and just say thank you very much for watching. Hope you're still enjoying, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.